serving our churches and we should be leaving around 8 o'clock and then we'll be back by the end of the day and you'll learn more on Wednesday with your small groups and also if you're in Dr. Hazeltine's or Mrs. Fales small group you do not need to bring a lunch because your church will be providing it. Okay, people, the Algoma News Awards are coming up and the votings are open, so just go on 2015algomanewsawards.weebly.com and vote for your favorite video. So you can just go on your phone, on your computer, browser, um, just go to 2015algomanewsawards.weebly.com and just vote. Thank you very much. Progress reports are coming out Friday, so don't get bad grades. So this Friday, all sixth graders and up are going to be serving our churches, and we should be leaving around 8 o'clock, and then we'll be back by the end of the day. And you'll learn more on Wednesday with your small groups, and also, if you're in Dr. Hazeltine's or Mrs. Fail's small group, you do not need to bring a lunch because your church will be providing it. I'm sorry. If you were right, I'd agree with you. Robin Williams. Today it's going to be a high of 62 and sunny. Tomorrow it's going to be a high of 64 and partly cloudy. And on Thursday it's going to be a high of 65 and 30% partly cloudy. Okay, and now we have the sports with Ben and Andrew who have the latest news in sports. Algoma. All right. Thank you, Tom. And uh, now we got some results from last Friday's baseball game. Already on Friday, the boys played a great game. They uh, won 5-4. to four. Ben did really good. He had 13 strikeouts. And on Saturday, the uh, soccer team, they won 3-2 to two against Zion in double overtime. It was an amazing game, so good job to them. And the baseball team lost against Zion. Yep, and now we're going to send it off to Mr. Scott for last night's results. Alright, thanks Ben, Andrew, and Tom. Two games last night. First in girls soccer. The girls improved their record to 6-1-1. One, and one. You know it's a sign of a good team when you don't play your best, but you still find a way to win. Last night Blair scored with a minute and 24 left to bring home the bacon. Kudos to the defense, including Lydia at keeper. There's a big week coming up this week for the girls. Could determine first place. So, in baseball, the guys came up a little bit short last night. They lost to Black River 8-12. to um, Ben and Jared, the Tuna Fortuna, pitched. But the team played uh, with a lot of errors last night, and that really hampered them. So, good job to Matt and Teddy, who had some great defensive plays in the field. And now back to you guys in the studio. Thanks. Thank you for that, Mr. Scott. All right, tonight the girls play a soccer game here at, uh, against Calvary Holland at 5 o'clock. Yep, and then on Thursday, the baseball team has a home game at the Algoma Sports Park. That's going to be at 4.30 against Potter's House, and that's going to be one game. And then the girls soccer team has an away game that night against Calvary Fruitport, so that's a big game. Yep. Yep, and uh, that's, that's all we got. We got.